and stared at this. I was thinking, isn't this weird? I sleep beside this thing. I have to like open and close the drapes uh, to the windows. And I can completely ignore this thing because it's here all the time, the war table. I'm in holiday mode. Um, this is going to be one, well, I think I've mentioned this in previous videos for sure, man. I, yeah, I can't just jump into this. It, it takes a very, very long time, probably a few hours to stare at the map. Already, though, I was like, okay, I've already uh, jumped back into the narrative bits. Militarily or strategically not happy with what the narrative is going to go for the Russians. I'll be honest with you, based on even stuff I've been reading recently, it's like, just focus on one spot. Uh, your, your front is ridiculously huge. I should be actually... Um, uh, watching um, World War One. Uh, oh, sorry. The uh, excuse me. The net uh, doesn't matter. You won't see this. This is a whatever. Focus on mammal. Nobody else. But the Tsar got into this. We're gonna go for Wuj as well, and still try to. Uh, well, we already have uh, Cernovitz, but um, try to. Well, consolidate that, cut off that flipping rail, cut off that rail as well. Too many things to do. Not enough whatevers. Uh, the thing is, the Germans are in deep F. They, they don't have a lot of stuff based on what I can see, even with the production uh, charts and so on and so forth. I brought, and this is unrealistic as far as I'm concerned. I ha I'll have to take a look at the translation or transcription or whatever you want to call it with real life and der Velkrieg rules. I brought over the equivalent, I think, of about 20 flippin' divisions, 105 strength points towards uh, the Eastern Europe conflict zone to shore up some spots because I was like, I can't, there's no way I can uh, deal with the tidal wave that's coming towards me. 20 divisions? Are you serious? That's a shit load of cores, man. That's all shit load of cores. As far as I know, it's like, what, 10 cores? That's nuts. Um, anyways, we'll see if, uh, yeah, focus on Memel and start um, peeling them like a, not like a can of worms, but like a tin opener. I'm just going to rip them open. I can but uh, like I said with the role play bits I've decided to incorporate the Zara here he wants to um, it was it, this is also in keeping with the historical Great War stuff due to the fact that the France and everybody was like for the love of certainly France Jesus H 99.9% of the big uh, combat was uh, done on their uh, territory let's be honest so no kidding they were begging for Russia, can you please, everybody signed a, right off the bat, early on, I was shocked, about because this is going to F up peace later on, obviously, when um, everybody agreed to, no, we're not going to sign a separate peace, because there was offers later on, and they're like, nope, uh, and that also helped later on offensively, when we said, okay, one person gets attacked, everybody goes. Right now, it's not there yet, I think. It's later on when they all decide, after Italy uh, um, pops up, they all start going, okay, if one person gets attacked, we all go mental. You know, it, obviously. Think about it even from a flipping game, like a, on a board game, you see that. Oh, God. Th therefore, game designers uh, modeled what was going on properly. When you start getting those constraints of um, there's attacks all over the place, you may not be, you know, effective. But overall, if you put your egg, most of your eggs in a certain basket and the other side, it, look, man, it's like uh, it's like hockey and so on and so forth. You, you, know, you, you know, like someone's got a good old, you know, wink and you go.
Good pass, good shot, off you go. Coordination. Strength in numbers in the right... You get the whole idea, for God's sakes. Yeah, so the Tsar wants to take Wooj. I'm like, <laughs> are you effing kidding me, man? Like, talk about adding um, salt to the wound. Like, we got to all... Like, we want to contract the freaking front, not extend it. Go back. He wants it. We do it. Jesus H. So what I'm trying to do operationally, still haven't figured out these. Remember, the, the big dude is uh, Dan and Olav here. The black Dan and Olav. I have to figure out why he was called that. But he's going to coordinate. He's doing this boom on, but everybody else has got north and south here. I have to figure out uh, who those people are, but we're gonna, I just want to be as sneaky as I can uh, within the constraints of whatever to um, nail Memo. As well as I know the Germans have been concentrating an absurd amount of freaking uh, artillery and uh, infantry there. I'm not effing stupid, I, can, I know what they want to do. But the Tsar wants me to do some crazy ass shit over here to reclaim some, uh, I don't know, um, credence or, I don't know, whatever, man. I'm just like, Jesus H, like, chill. <laughs> Go do whatever. I don't know, just, <clears throat> there's other stuff to do. I just got, like, this is nuts. Like I said, though, on the flip side, I've got to run, the Austrians haven't even talked about them, eh? I just got to hope the flipping God that the other fronts, which I'm going to abstract the living dickens out of, can cause the Austrians to not send so much um, reinforcements up. Otherwise, it's not going to be good. And then I'm going to go on the other side and try to nail the Russians as much as I can, man. Oh... I've got, uh, I don't go back to holiday time till, uh, I think I've mentioned before, uh, 4th of November. This is just trying to get back into the swing of things, man. It's just back into the swing of things. I need to, like, sit back, stir, oh, smoke meat sandwich. What the, where the hell is that coming from? Yeah, they're tough to eat. To be honest with you, let's be honest. Well, no, not really. To cook properly, a lot of moisture during the cooking process, so they're tender. Um, I've never, to be honest with you, enjoyed <laughs> a smoked meat sandwich. I've had them a few times, but I'm like, eh, it's just not my, uh, it's just not my cup of tea, man. I know where you're going, but um, I'd rather do that with like a good. Um, Melt in your mouth roast beef, to be honest with you. All right. Yeah, I'll get back to this. <sighs> yes, 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 yes. Uh, this is... I keep forgetting this place is my... is my little paradise. This is my paradise. It really is. Okie doke. I'll turn this thing off because <laughs> I sound like a moron from hell. More than usual. How's that? Hope you're having fun, Matt. See ya.